Welcome back, Nerd Squad. My name is Roya Destroya, and this is Top 10 Nerd. Image Comics Al Simmons, known as Spawn, first debuted in 1992. Now our interest in him has been rekindled because of a certain recent announcement, so we decided to take a look at the different spawns we've encountered over the years. He may not have alternate versions in the same way that Marvel and DC characters do, but he's got several spin offs worth mention. So let's take a look at the top 10 alternate versions of Spawn. In the number 10 spot is Movie Spawn. Spawn the film premiered in 1997. The titular character was played by Michael J. White and was actually the first movie to have a black actor playing a major superhero role. It takes on his origin story, but it doesn't exactly do a great job. The film received negative reviews across the board. So we can't say this is one of the best Spawn incarnations out there, but it's all we got for the moviegoers at the moment. Got your attention now. Next at number 9, we got Shadows of Spawn. Shadows of Spawn is a manga at Adaptation of the original character, written by Juzo Takoro. This heavily stylized version of Spawn is a street criminal named Ken, who hires himself out to provide for himself and his sickly young sister. He's killed on a job and re emerges as a Hell Spawn, supposedly at the same time that the original Spawn came back to life as well. Now his duty lies in protecting his sister, who has gone on to become a teen actress. But of course, the more protective he is, the more danger follows. Coming in at number 8 is Iced Earth Spawn. This is a funny one now. Iced Earth is a metal band from Florida that released an album known as The Dark Saga. The Dark Saga is a concept work that is based on the story of Spawn, so they carved their own character through music. Now, while Spawn creator Todd McFarlane agreed to work on the cover art, he wasn't completely on board with the idea of the whole Spawn story, so the band had to do their whole saga without mentioning his name. Buzzkill McFarlane. In the number 7 spot, we have McFarlane Toys. Yes, the toy version of Spawn makes the list, and for good reason. This set of Spawn toys was released in 1994, and due to their extreme level of detailing, they stood out from the rest of figurines on the shelves at the time. They also all came with their own comics individualized to the character sold. This attention to detail made a name for McFarlane toys and really put them on the map as a manufacturer of highly sought out toys. So, therefore, this version of Spawn more than deserves his place on the list. Up at number six is Hell Spawn. This was an avant garde spin off of Spawn that was a much more darker version of the character, although the character is pretty dark to begin with. The atmosphere is a lot more intense. And the character dealt with some heavier subject matters such as suicide and abuse. The character's origin and story remain pretty consistent with the original, but the grimy artwork and gloomier plots are reason to give this alternate guy a try. Coming in at number 5, we have Medieval Spawn. This is another version of Spawn introduced in the main book in the ninth issue. He was a Hellspawn knight named Sir John of York from the 19th century. He was responsible for killing the Archbishop of Canterbury, mistaking the king's angry words for an order of death. Because of this, he was released from service and swiftly killed when he asked for forgiveness. Medieval people are so metal. That's of course how he became a Hellspawn, and really all he wanted was a chance to redeem himself. Then he got killed again. That's life, kids. Next up at number 4 is Adventures of Spawn. The Adventures of Spawn was a new take on the character as the protagonist of a what if style story. This version of her guy is known as Spawn X and must fight off villainous forces from collecting the relics of ruin. You may have guessed it, but this was McFarlane's attempt at marketing the Spawn character to a more kid centric audience. The colorful pages and action packed storyline are sure to please the kiddies, even if he's not exactly the dark and brooding Spawn we know. Up next at number 3, we got the animated series Spawn. This version is shockingly from the animated show, Tom McFarlane's Spawn. The show premiered in 1997 and it only ran for three seasons, but it was around long enough for an Emmy winner too, so that's pretty big. Familiar backstory, Spawn was voiced by Keith David, who did some amazing work capturing the character's moods. The show was quite the hit, mostly due to the fact that nobody expected that much from it to begin with. It's good to have low expectations, I always say. In the number two spot is the Dark Ages Spawn. Back to the comfort of the dark here. Spawn, the Dark Ages, was a series whose main character was Lord Covenant, a knight from the 12th century who was killed and returned as a Hellspawn, obviously, or he wouldn't be on the list. As we know how the English countryside can be, this was a time of violent turmoil, and our new Hellspawn must choose whether to give in to the darkness overtaking the countryside, or come to the aid of the innocent but shattered kingdom peasants. Mmm, helpless little peasants, powerful and enticing dark side, the choice is pretty hard. And finally, in the number one spot, we have the new movie Spawn. The 
reason this list was put together in the first place. Taking our top spot today is the Spawn to Be that will start in the Spawn reboot, which we desperately hope is better than the first 1997 version who was in our 10th spot. Jamie Foxx will play the main man, although it's reported that we won't actually see much of Spawn himself. Rather, he will be the monster lurking in the shadows while the spotlight rests on private investigator Twitch Williams. Will it work? Only time will tell. So those are the top 10 alternate versions of Spawn. Let me know in the comment section down below who you want alternate versions of next. My name is Rory Destroya, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss another nerdy list.